I always wanted to kill a moose. So I went to Canada and this resort owner, he said, I'll fix you up. He saw him that night, he said, we're going to, I'm going to find you a moose. He said, I've got a float plane. And he said, we'll get up in the morning and we'll take that float plane. We'll locate one on an island, on a lake somewhere. So we did. Anyway, make a long story short, I killed it and took us all day and two big strong Indians to get it back into camp. Had to quarter it and fly it in in a float plane and jack around. And, um, he said, you going to take that moose with you? I said, yeah, I'm going to take it with me. I said, that's, that's the first one I've ever killed and it'll probably be the last one I'll ever kill. And, uh, he said, what did you fly in, in, in here? I flew. I said, I flew in in, 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 a boot, in a beaver. He said, well, you can't take that moose, can't fly that moose out in a, me, uh, in a beaver because it weighed about 1,400 pounds. He said, it'll take a twin beach to get it out and get you all out of here. And I said, well, if that's what it takes, that's what, that's what it takes, and I'm going to take it out of here. So the next morning, I woke up there, that big twin beach, float plane was sitting out there and that's when the expense started. I told them to take it to a plant and have it processed and send it to me at Fort Leonard Wood, Missouri. So in about two or three weeks they called me and at Fort Wood and said my moose was over at Fort Wood. <laughs> Went over and got it. I think I got two steaks out of it. <laughs> Everyone wanted, wanted meat out of that damn moose. That moose cost me more damn money than any trip I ever made in my whole life. <laughs> I, I regret the day I ever shot it. <laughs> and coming back, I flew, I flew into St. Paul, Minnesota, and was waiting for a plane to, to St. Louis. And this little old red-faced guy coming down the aisle, and he said, Do you own those antlers in the in the plane? I said, yeah. I said, they're mine. He said, I'm going to throw them damn things out, to, out of the plane. I said, you throw that at, throw them out of the plane and you'll throw, I'll throw you out with them. <laughs> I said, you don't know what I went through to get those antlers. And I finally got him calmed down. He said, well, there's a door back there. There's a twine and paper and stuff. He said, you get, you get that thing covered up. He says, it's taken... <laughs> Sticking holes in the baggage of the antlers of that moose. <laughs> yeah.